Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm not going to be doing a favourites video. There's two reasons why. So I don't have tons and tons to talk about but also it's been my birthday so typically I do a what I got for my birthday video and because I don't really do hauls because I don't really buy enough to do hauls anyway so I just thought I'd talk about because I've got a few new makeup bits a few new fashiony bits so what I'm going to be trying out in the month to come so let's get crack a so I'm going to start with a present from me to me and it's this bag here so back when I was in the depths of uni despair i bought this bag it's by a brand called jw pay so they do like pre-orders for bags so i pre-ordered this i showed it was a couple of months and then they ship it out and they uh, they ship internationally from china so it takes a couple of weeks to get here but the availability date was from the 5th of july so i thought oh just in time for my birthday and a sort of well done for finishing second year present ding 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 is this little bag here so uh it's called the i think it's a spring summer envelope chain bag it doesn't fit a whole host in here, but I have been loving it. I think it's beautiful. I think it's amazing. I'm thinking of doing a video on my JW Pay bags because they're vegan and they're made out of recycled plastic and I'm all into that. So um, I thought I might review them. Tell me if that's something you'd like to see. But anyway, this is my new squeeze. And also talking about sort of, cause I've got like a lot of like money uh, to, put, to put towards stuff. Like I've just ordered some furniture, but that's gonna take a while to come. Uh, and then also I've got like an experience like my boyfriend bought me tickets to see Hot Chip, the band. Uh, but one thing that I did put money towards was these, which I must admit I did order before my birthday. But anyway, is these shoes. They're by Jeffrey Campbell. <sighs> Listen, I'm gonna put one down, but hold the other. I feel like I have had buyer's regrets of the autumn winter trend that's just been of white boots. And I just, I feel like, cause I wear boots all year round that wearing white ones, that's kind of like, ooh, summer. And I saw these on ASOS, you know, obviously because the more it gets close to summer, the less boots are being sold. But I saw these on ASOS and I just could not get them out of my head. And they're Jeffrey Campbell, so they're not cheap. But then because I think they're not cheap, they were 30% off and I just, I mean, they were still expensive, but they've got like a sil oh, sorry, silver hardware, which I'm into. And it's like, uh, got like sort of the, toes cut off oh i just i love them they're my vince noir boots i'm a massive fan and oh i love them i love them so moving on to a very practical present this is from my friend hannah who watches my videos hello hannah seriously nailed it so as you guys will know big pink my camelback eddie bottle i have had since the end of 2017 because i looked up for the warranty um, uh, and that's a long time to be using a daily water bottle anyway so basically these eddie water bottles they have like a little plastic um nubbin i don't know what you want to call it um mouthpiece that's probably better than nubbin isn't it um, but yeah so they have those and mine split a bit so if i was drinking it at home it was fine but if i put it in my bag it would often leak uh, anyway, but Camelback do a lifetime guarantee, so I applied online dee -dee -dee -dee, um, to get the spare parts. However, because I live outside of the US, I think it may take forever for me to get the parts. But anyway, in between that, Hannah bought me this one for my birthday. So this is again a one litre bottle, but this is, no, no, it's not just the Camelback Eddie. It's the Camelback Eddie Plus. And basically there's a few little differences, predominantly with this, the shape is slightly different, this is slightly bigger, the nubbin is slightly different, but it seems apparently there's 25% more flow. Yeah, I looked it up. But also, yeah, the nubbins are slightly different, and I don't think I noticed how much of a difference not having big pink in my life made it, because also I threw away the mouthpiece, because I was like, I'm done with you leaking over my stuff, we'll just wait for the other one, not really thinking about it. This is the best water bottle. This one's a litre, you can get smaller ones, but... Honey, just, just go for the litre. This, by the way, it's about one o'clock when I'm filming this. This is my second bottle of water that I've gone through and it's here. So I've almost drank two litres and we're like halfway through the day. So, big fan. So of course, naturally, I got a few foodie bits and we'll start with this. This is from my boyfriend. He got me the Vegan Elephant Organic and Vegan Cookies. Um, so it's like a cookie selection box. I mean, there's two flavours. So everything's like biodegradable, organic, super hippy dippy. It also comes with a tin. If I wish to transport my cookies, I have that. 
Um, but yeah, this pe this packaging is biodegradable. Um, he got them on Amazon, um, and I think they do make a nice present. I I'd never personally heard of them, but he's like, I always see it when I look them up, but um, like look up vegan stuff online. Anyway, I've got it comes with double chocolate chip and vanilla chocolate chip. So um, they're very tasty. They're very good with like a cup of coffee. They're the type of biscuit. They're a good dunker. They're a very good dunker. So um, yeah, if you know somebody who is considering veganism. Uh, this is nice little, nice little gift pack. And yeah, as I said, I think these literally go perfectly with coffee. So that's my recommendation. I did also get the classic foodie bits uh, from some of my friends, uh, my friends Sarah and Ben. They got me some shortcake squares and some rice squares from Asdol's because they also bought me a candle. So let's move on to the candle portion of the video. I got two candles. Let's make it sound like I got ten. I got two. So let's start off with this one here. It kind of looks like a jar. When I first got it, I was turning it around, but no babes, you just pop it up. This is coconut and, oh sorry, coconut sublime, get it? I think it's coconut and lime lads, that's what I think. It smells really fresh, it smells really summery. Um, I'm actually still burning that dip tea candle I got for Christmas because I was like rashing it so much and then just kind of stopped burning candles. But then I was like, no, I like candles. Yeah, this is definitely, I think, the one I'm gonna burn next because it is so summery and it is the season. It's Leo season, baby. Pow, pow. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, but then also, my pal Seth Sophie got me a lime leaf and ginger candle. So she lives above like a super swish tat shop. Not tat shop, but like cute little knickknack shop. Um, so this is, I imagine she went downstairs and picked this one out. But yeah, it's just very nice and simple. And this one again, because it's got that sort of liminess to it, it's um, still quite summery, but really tart. Again, I'm a really big fan of like fresh smelling candles. I'm not. I mean, ginger's actually, it's fine in here, but I'm not like crazy on the really like heady scents. I like really like fresh scents and both of these are that. So, thank you ladies. Uh, ooh, maybe the most fun present I got is from my friend Stace and so I opened this. Actually, she got me two things, but it's up there. So, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, but it's a Marilyn Manson beach towel. Yeah, Mazza Mazza. Oh wow, that's a lot of, a lot of black and white. This is, uh, I mean, actually, do you know what? It's already come in handy. So I had a party for my birthday around my house and I filled up like a, a plastic bin with water and ice to like keep things cool. Put this on the table, safety first. This is genius because I have had the same beach towel. So I've got like a fold up microfiber one, but I've also got like the same beach towel like since I was like six. It's 101 Dalmatians. And it's at my parents' house, so now I've got a Marilyn Manson one, a bit more on brand. I do also have a few makeup bits. Can you guess where they're from? Actually, this one's not from it. Again, this is a present from my boyfriend. And it's by Lime Crime. My boyfriend, buddy, whenever I need, whenever it's like present time, whether it's like my birthday or Christmas, my boyfriend always, that's when he watches my videos to be like, what am I talking about that I would like? I mean, he came through, didn't he? So this is the Lime Crime plushie in Sorbet. This is the one that I mentioned literally in my favorites video last month. So hats off to the boy. Let's hear it for the boy. That's a song, isn't it? Anyway, so uh, I'm not wearing that lipstick today. I'm wearing another one, but um, I've worn this a couple of times. So it's really nice. Uh, I'm a big fan. So thanks babes. But then the rest of the stuff's actually from my brother from Glossier. Um, I've spoken about this before. My brother and I are very straightforward, very straight talking. I tell him exactly what I want. I send him the link and I get it. It's, it's a two way street and it works wonderfully for the pair of us. Anyway, so I actually got two sets from Glossier. So the first one is the brow set. So depending on how up to date with Glossier products you are, they very recently brought out the brow, they very recently brought out the brow flick. I, I need to put my teeth back in today, honestly, lads. Anyway, so it's like a brow pen, very similar to the Tattoo Liner by Kat Von D, like that format, like the little hairs. Um, I've got it in the shade brown, as you can imagine. And I've got to admit, I've got it in my brows today. I'm needing to play around with this. This is a new format of product for me. So I'm trying to make it work before I give my opinion. It makes it sound like, I'm, I'm basically, I'm just used to doing my brows one way and I'm figuring it out. But then I've also got the Hero product, which is boy brow in brown. Um, I have been like scraping the barrel of my brow gel. So I'm happy to have a fresh one back in my life. This is in brown. I love this product so much so. The second set I got 
also has it in. Um, so again, that's just another boy brow in brown. But as I've mentioned before, I'd lost my favorite lipstick from uh, Glossier and they'd also reformulated it. So I got a repurchase slash the updated version of the Generation G lipstick in Leo. That's what I've got on my lips with my favorite lip liner, the Milani lip liner in 09 Spice. Um, I, what I will say is they've added a fragrance and I don't know how I feel about it. It's very perfumed, but I don't know if I can just smell it more because the sort of bullets bigger. But yeah, I mean, it's more or less the same color. Although I'm finding it a little bit stiffer. Again, it's new. I need to work with it. You know what I mean. And um, what's also fun is because they're bringing out like more apparel and that um, and accessories. Uh, my brother was like, I could put in a code and you could get some hair clips. So these have actually come in handy. I've been clipping my hair back when I've been doing my makeup with these. Little bonus. Um, oh, it's got like a sticker as well. So that's nice. And I guess the biggest present that I got was from my parents. Hold please. It's over here. It's a new camera. Uh, so this is the Canon EOS M100. It's got a little flippy up screen. And basically I'm going on a little bit of a Euro trip this summer. And as much as I like my Olympus pen, which is like a very similar style of camera, but by Olympus, not by Canon. It's a little bit outdated now, I feel like. I wanted something a little bit more up to date. And this is just, so like this has the flash built in, the flash is separate on that. And I'm just finding it a little bit clunky. I did also buy myself this strap. It's from Amazon. Uh, just because again, one thing I found why I wasn't using that camera as much as I thought I would is it would really hurt my shoulder. So um, I bought this strap, which A, looks cool, but it's also um, a lot more comfy and a lot more fun to wear. What's fun is my new handbag like sits here, like let's say it sits here on my hip and this sits like just above it because this doesn't fit in it, which I was a bit like, Ooh, when the bag came, it was, so the bag when it came was smaller than what I thought it would be, but that's almost a good thing because I thought it looked a bit big. Anyway, doesn't mean that I can't fit this in because this camera, it, the lens doesn't go in or anything like that. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is I'm going to be moving back to the vlogs. I'm going to start with my trip, which starts mid-August, and we'll see how we go from there. But um, I'm really excited about this, actually. It's a really nice bit of kit. I think a really good price point as well. So I'm excited to get using this. Why don't I show you what it looks like? Woo! So this is how things are going to be looking. How do you feel? This is actually the first time I've filmed on it, so I'm a bit like, ooh. Also, do you like that I sat ooh, in front of my mess? <laughs> uh, but I sat in the part of my room where the lighting's good. Anyway, so I got a new camera. That means new vloggy stuff. That is about, oh, that's a lie. I got some skin. Ha, hold please. There's more to come. I've been so spoiled. I did actually get some skincare stuff. So I got two bits from my housemate. So she got me, well, let's start with this one first. So she got me a Pixie Glow Tonic. Big fan of an exfoliating toner. Once I finished the one that I'm using now, I will definitely happily move on to this. It's been a while since I've had this one. But also, Pixie have extended their Glow Tonic range and included this. I think it was because she saw a product that I'm using in the shower. So she thought, ooh, maybe she'll like this. Uh, this is their Glow Mud Cleanser, uh, which has glycolic acid in, aloe vera. So it's kind of a nice accompaniment with that one. So um, yeah, once I'm finished using what I'm using, I think I'm gonna move on to those. But also, staying on the skincare front, I put this back in the wrapping, because I'm out when I got it, but this is from my auntie, and it's the Ever Classic Lizzo Cleanse and Polish. I don't think I can get past like a celebration time without either my auntie or my mum buying me this product. It's just very comprehensive, and it works for everyone. So, um, and they know that I use it. I use this personally in the shower. This is what I use to wash my face. Um, cause also definitely I am such a wuss when it comes to showers. I shower very, I have very cold showers. I feel like abnormally cold showers. So I wash my face in the shower. I know you're not supposed to, but I thought I'd put that disclaimer out. Um, but also fished out of the shower is this here. So this is from my mum. This is the Philip Kingsley, uh, elasticizer. Now I used to talk about this all the time. But when I moved out, because my mum and I used to share. So she bought me my own to have at my place. Uh, this is their limited edition Rose and Lychee. I think it's just to do with scents. Um, it's QVC's beauty pick of the month in July. I don't know if this is going to be up whilst July's still on. But anyway, she got me that. And last, but certainly not least, a litre of gin. Uh, my housemate, my other housemate got me this. It's not open yet, but I'm sure 
I'm sure we got cracked out sooner rather than later. That is everything from me. If there are any videos you'd like to see from me over, not July, haha, <laughs> that's over, over the next couple of weeks, over the summer, then please let me know. I'd love to hear from you. I shall see you very soon. Cheers, guys. Bye.